He looked confused. I'll ask my mom, he said. He came back holding his shoes. We rode bikes and played on the trampoline. Jeremy's mom made us at lunch. After lunch, we went to my house. It was strange. I was kind of having fun with my enemy, but I couldn't tell Dad that since he had worked so hard on the enemy pie. Jeremy knew how to throw a boomerang. He threw it and it came right back to him. I threw it and it went into my backyard. When we climbed over the fence to find it, the first thing Jeremy noticed was my treehouse. Can we go in it, he asked. I knew he was going to ask that, but he was the top person, the only person on my enemy list, and enemies aren't allowed in my treehouse. But he did teach me to throw a boomerang, and he did let me play on his trampoline. He wasn't being a very good enemy. Okay, I said, but hold on. I climbed up first and tore the enemy list off the wall. We played games until my dad called us down for dinner. Dad made macaroni and cheese, my favorite. Jeremy's too. Maybe Jeremy Ross wasn't so bad after all. I was beginning to think that we should just forget about the enemy pie. Why does the narrator tear down his enemy list? Pause and think about why did the narrator tear down his enemy list.